Somebody, yeah, that's my Maserati going ham. No salami, that's your chick. If I like it, then I'm straight. Both garden in a club. Where the bottles that rose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, the guys, and welcome back to another episode of Sub Nordica. So, today I want to start with a video of, well, self scanning myself first. Self scan complete. Bacterial infection in your system is progressing. That's great. Detecting skin irritation and immune system response. Further data required to identify bacterial strain. That's even better. Oh god. Anyway, so now with Jonathan, um, well, greater than made, we can, well, I guess carry on exploring the place more. We still have this so that then you didn't even bother to put this stuff away that's it, so good enough. Yeah. So, what did I actually even try to make or want to make last episode? Because I have terrible memories, so now. <sighs> Wait, my inventory seems bigger than usual. It is. Whatever. Oh yeah, these trees are... have regrown on. We've got a message. We shouldn't be getting messages, like... What day is it? It's already day 57, so... We shouldn't probably be getting messages, but whatever. Oh, you've made me some water, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, let's go and check out that message then. See what it says. And we're gonna check out what else we can actually make it do and well. I need to actually make the depth module mark um, free, the last one. So I think that's what we're gonna try to make. The last depth module. Anyway, let's listen to the message. This is life pod 2 coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Okay, so that is life for two over there. To PDA. Yeah, 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 sure. So we're probably gonna go there, but that's 500 meters. And our Seamoth can go to, I think, exactly 500 meters too. So I think I wanna upgrade it first, and then we can actually start heading to that life pod. Yeah, that's the only life pod that we actually can go to. That's only, yeah, because there, there's only life pod signal, apart from the Grand Reef as well. So. To make the upgraded um thing I just have to um depth module, I think we need this tree's grown. Yeah. Looks smaller than usual. <coughs> <coughs> Jesus, sorry about that. Anyway, the repulsion cannon, yes, we can make it now, but um we don't even have the propulsion cannon, so pretty useless. And we mark Free, yes, okay, so we're using plastic link and then free rubies. God damn it, we need to go back there for a while to set a ruby. So annoying, so annoying. Good. Wait, they remove the bottom to give feedback. That's very annoying. Now you can still access this, but they remove the bottom to give feedback. Which is pretty annoying, you see? Now when I try to enable hacks, I can't because the F8 button that, well, enables the feedback. Oh, still works. Never mind then. I um, must have been messing up. Whatever, so now, um, yeah, item Ruby. Hmm. Oh. Well, it seems like we gotta get it ourselves. <laughs> so, yeah, we need three rubies. Plasti lingots. Okay, so I think I can. So, the death module we have in Jonathan. The plasti lingots, I need two lithium, which we have a lot of. And a lot of titanium. One, two, three, four, five. No, how many do we have actually? One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah, four. We need um we need ten. But I don't have some don't I have some lithium in the storage? I do. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Okay, good. Which means that item titanium. Very convenient. Now we have one, two, three, four, five, okay. And when we will make this, we will have. Uh, shall we just? I think we should just make both actually. Yeah. More water. Oh, why not? Our inventory is full. Amazing. Whatever, I just have to stay there then. So let's go. Um, let's see, I can't even sleep. Actually, no, no, I, I can't. I don't want to sleep. Oh, god damn it, I accidentally slept. Kill me now. Ah. I hate myself. Why did I sleep? So annoying. But it's gonna say that I can't, I'm not sleepy enough. God damn it. Whatever. So let's go. And I just need two lithium. I don't have. Okay. Let's just scrub this all into titanium. Could get a better. 
what is that? Oh, it's a solar eclipse. So it is it's actually dead. It's just a solar eclipse, I think. Ah, that's good. Whatever. A fabricator. What is it? What do you call titanium? Let's just craft as much titanium as we can. And then we can start making what we need to make. And we still need, we'll still need those rubies, which means that we still need to go to the Grand Reef anyway. And it's pretty inconvenient. So I just need you want titanium in here. I just need to mix that with two lithium. Which is pretty inconvenient too, but whatever. Let's go back to base cooking. And it's still day, but I think it's going to be night any second now. Because the sun is setting as far as I'm concerned. Which is not good. Let me just upload my video. Publish my video even. My Happy Wheels video, which, well, in that video I just moan about how Happy Wheels is just all unoriginal and boring. That's what it is, let's be honest here. Yeah. Anyway, put away most of this stuff. Yeet. Okay, take two lithium. One, two. Put away the all a million stuff that we have. Actually, wait, do you have titanium or lithium in here? Yes, okay. Gotta take this, gotta charge my computer. I'm gonna put this one single lithium in here. So all the lithium will be in here. Yeah, we have two rupees in here, three. Whatever. Let's just get all the components that we need, which is the titanium ingot, which I'm gonna craft. I mean, yeah. And three rupees, which I do not have. So, like, I can ruby. I can't even spawn them in, which is pretty interesting. And they were called something. They were called something different before they got renamed to ruby. Did they get renamed? A ceiling. Very nice. Now we just need one single ruby. So, um, no. <laughs> nope, doesn't work. Bye. <laughs> We're in the Grand Reef. And the terrain hasn't even loaded in yet. Oh, sweet Jesus. There we are. But the terrain looks so weird not loaded in. Disable the fog. Yeah, we're definitely in the Grand Reef, most likely. Now, oh, you see how this, you see how weirdly the terrain loads in? So interesting. Whatever. While we're here with no food, no nothing, let's go and see if we can find some rubies. And the quicker the better, by the way. You know? Just see. Okay, lead is useless. Most useless component in the goddamn game. Anyway, nothing more warpers here. There are warpers here, which I'm gonna have to. Do. See how much damage they heal? Oh, Jesus. These warpers are powerful. There's no rubies. I cannot even spawn any rubies in. I can't. Do, I cannot do anything. Simply can't do anything. Membrane tree. Actually, you know what? Warp me. Back at base. I'm gonna be creative. Let's go quickly into creative mode. And now we can craft what we need to craft. Because we are in creative. Yay! We can craft anything. Yes, I'm just gonna make this. Yeah, I do have two out of three, but whatever. She, um, because I'm not bothered to get that one single ruby. Like, no, I'm not gonna get that ruby. These are too far away from each other. One camera drone isn't even connected. I think it's camera one. Yeah. Camera one isn't even connected. How inconvenient. Yeah, what the hell are you doing all the way over here? Get back to base, you piece of punk. What is he doing all the way over there? That's what I want to know. Like, what the hell? Very good. The camera drones are, yeah, back together. So, you know, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I need to get rid of these. Yeah, okay, I don't want to do I'm going to do so it basically counts like new craft mix, so I'll get this, get this depth module, unequip good, and now, yeah, all these stuff, so I'm gonna go and go to Aurora, they go to Aurora, now I'm gonna drop all this stuff here, drop, 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 including this depth module, goodbye rubies, now I'm gonna go and warp me back to base. And you see, I am now back, still in creative mode, and I'm gonna craft this um, upgrade module. But in, basically, I d deleted all the other stuff, so it basically means that I just cheated to get one diamond. So, um, survival. 
Very nice. Here we are. We're back. We are back. So, now, with this calamity that we just done, put this back in. Now, with the fully upgraded depth module, we can go all the way up to 900 meters. Jonathan, let's go. Actually, I think we're gonna actually sleep first, because, yeah. Let's go sleep. Sleep in. Welcome aboard Cap Systems Online. Get in. Get in. No, I said, oh my god. You know what get in means? Oh. Oh my god, I can't, I can't even think. I couldn't even hear. Whatever, let's just quickly sleep. No, sleep. Jesus. Here we go, I'll smack a head against that a million times. No, go, go away. Use this one, one, of the, one out of the 20 million methods that we have. I cannot sleep, okay. I don't need to sleep. We've got an hour message, okay. Let's then go back to. Well, let's go here, I guess. Read the thingamajibba. Yes, to the lifeboat named the thingamajibba. Here we are. Listen to the message. Oh god. Destroyed. Welcome aboard, Captain. So, oh yeah, I'm apparently the only one human left because those All weird things just told me. That's amazing. Let's go towards the signal then and pretend that that never got that happened. <laughs> yeah, those were the war those were the warpers talking to me, and they just told me that I that they killed everyone apart from me. So it's amazing. Very amazing. Oh god, let's just go to this lifeboat. CTO used the lifeboat song 500 meters before she abandoned it. She probably died, let's be honest, yeah. If she didn't die, then the warp was probably dealt with her. And we're going, I think, towards the second blood, um, blood vine zone place thing. So, yeah, there's a lot of warpers there, so she probably got eliminated by one of them. Anyway, yeah, okay, let's just go. The quicker we get there, the more we can do, oh yes. Jonathan as well, so he decided to smack himself against the goddamn wall, which was very dumb of him to do for Jonathan. Very dumb, very dumb. Now, a fish just smacked me. Fish, you little piece of wood. You know what, I actually picked this up. I probably don't need it, but I'm gonna take it back. Where the hell even are we? Oh yes, I know where we are. In the middle of goddamn nowhere. Get the hell out of here. I'm not gonna pick up all of the things because might be more things to find here. Might be, I don't know. I'll just, it's only meant to be like a quick get in, get the stuff and go back mission because I want to go probably. Like, this is just the second bloodvine zone. Uh, so there's, there's, there's no, nothing there. Just a part of the normal bloodvine place. So I think I want to go back to the Grand Reef after we search out for this life one. If we manage to get to it, that is, because if it's able to fall, just wait. Still recording, yeah, good. Just look at the amount of goddamn islands here. And sharks, of course. Now go away, go kill yourself. Super shark, but look at the amount of islands. Well, is that a main big one? Never actually saw that one. Whatever, oh, see, here we are. The second blood bind. Ah, I'm gonna attack, then ambush. Let's maybe get the hell out of here before we get totally destroyed. It's so eerie here. Oh god, let's just repair the report and let's go. We made it. Ah, oh, the second blood vine zone. So, huh? Yeah, more warpers. That scream was a warper, so. You know, there's warpers here. It's probably eliminated CTOU. She probably didn't swim to the surface. She probably did. She definitely didn't make it. Whatever. Let's just get to base. Oh. Oh, great. It is a um, headcrab going through the wall. Recap. Yep, there is a headcrab going through the wall, right? Now, there's the life pod. It's gone. Turn under the map and disappear. Stupid headcrab. No, I just turned the fog off. Recap. Yeah, good. You're back. Okay. Oh Jesus! I don't know what's going to happen. 
close to this. Ah, uh, nothing. It's a crack in the world. There it is. Life pod number two. Was here first. Cyclops death module mark one. Hell yeah. Be good. Was in here. Abandoned PDA. Chief, yeah, let's just listen to this. Flotation devices failed. We're flooding. Evacuate. Wait. I can reconfigure the O2 system to act as a bilge pump. It's working. Okay, good news. We're alive and we've stopped sinking. Bad? The oxygen's going to run out in 30 minutes and we're 500 meters down. What do we do? We'll have to use the remaining juice to send a distress call and build whatever gear we can. Then we find a way to the surface. Okay. And so actually I spotted this big cave over here, right there. What actually even is this cave? No, I like this music clip. What the hell is this cave gonna be, huh? Huh? Reveal yourself, cave. Reveal yourself. Where the hell are we even going? So we're currently in the blood vine zone place, cave. That's pretty easy. So where the hell does this lead us, huh? Where are we going now, huh? Where is the trip door now? It's gonna be a quick trip. Show a nearby opening, leading to a biome with extensive fossilized remains. I think we're currently in that biome. Wait, oh, I know where we are. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Lost River. And Jesus Christ, that is a ghost leviathan over there. Let's maybe not go towards it. Let's actually, I wanna go show you the ghost leviathan. Free camp. Over here, right? Yeah. There it is. This is the ghost leviathan, but that's one on the map. But well, guys, beware. That is a juvenile ghost leviathan. Yes, that's a baby. This is a baby ghost leviathan. This is a baby. There is bigger ones. 20 times bigger. While it's under the map, let's actually use it, use it to our advantage to get the hell out of here. So, see more. So we're going in the Lost River and uh, unloaded Lost River. Let's just let's load it. Yes. So we have made it Lost River, guys. Welcome to the Lost River, ladies and gentlemen. Built at a place with dumb things like that. But this is the Lost River. And I, I knew that it was here. I just that's the why that's the reason I wanna make that death mode. Because we're under five hundred meters now and we wouldn't we wouldn't we wouldn't have been able to get here without the depth module, so that's the reason I wanted to make it. It's so dark here, like even without the fog, it's even worse without the fog. What if we make it day? We do anything because we're in the middle of a cave. Amazing. Okay, I know kind of how this place is built, but yeah, and I kind of know that we're going to die. Okay, that kind of helps. It is eerily dark. Very dark here. Relatively interesting as well. So. Hmm, it seems like we're going down. Some kind of cave, I guess. Um, some river. Because this, this is the lost river, so what do you expect? Okay. And oh, where, where, where have we made it to now? Oh yeah, here. What's this, huh? What is this? Uh, oh, Jesus Christ. This is a huge leviathan. A dead huge leviathan. That's kind of cool. Leviathan skeletal remains. Yeah, okay, I'm getting burned, Jesus. Let me just scan this place. The sea dragon skeleton. Oh, God. Well, this is, ladies and gentlemen, a sea dragon. Let's read. No, not that. Alien data. Terminal data. No, not terminal data. Blueprints. I don't need blueprints. So, whatever. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Very nice. Where are we? What's this? What is this? Pillar. Thing. Play. Huh? Huh? These are kind of like the alien structures. Oh, sweet Jesus. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it seems like we just found an alien base. Ah, the fog doesn't help. We can see the aurora. <laughs> Dodgy. Anyway, well, ladies the and gentlemen. The structure appears to have collapsed to the sea floor. Yeah. 
Kurt, oh god, I'm scared of hell on me. No, no, go away. Go away, stupid thing. I'm gonna get inside this thing before we get murdered. Oh god, the lag. So this, ladies and gentlemen, is a freaking abandoned base or destroyed base. There, an entrance. Get it? Yeah, this uh, alien base that has been destroyed, as you can probably see. So we can fix up Jonathan. Okay, let's, see, let's go and fix ourselves up. Okay, that's our last. That's our last message. Oh. Uh, Detecting an alien broadcast. Linguistic analysis reads: Caution. Hazardous materials and life forms contained within. Yeah. It's five. It's, it's look. You can see here. It's five degrees. In Interior Jesus. walls in this section are substantially reinforced, indicating the designers were seeking either to keep something out or contain it within. Whatever their intention, it clearly failed. Clearly. Okay, it's so dark here. Yeah, I'm so sorry about that. But what's here? So now one of these. Okay. Let's open this. Actually, wait. Let's quickly go. Before we open that, let's go into um the alien, the alien data terminal. Yeah, no, for a special schedule. Hmm. And data. Alien data. Pretty interesting. No, alien data, open up. Scan data, terminal data, alien terminal data. No, no, I thought I had a different thing. Whatever. Actually, should, that should be codes and clues, right? Codes and clues. Let's quickly close some of these things because it's so annoying. What the hell are codes and clues, huh? Advanced various blueprints, data downloads, codes and clues right there. You yeah, see, alien facility location, disease research fertility. I think we're at the, you see, depth 800 meters. We're pretty much 800 meters. Case of extensive fossil record, southwest of reinforcement platform. That isn't. Yeah, okay. So we are actually at the um, alien disease research facility place thing. <laughs> and let's just use our single tablet that we have and get in. This force field thing. Okay, what's this? Specimen research data. Okay. A catalog of information. Yeah. Unidentified. Un. Un. In. Unidentified Leviathan. This Leviathan species has been assigned has been assigned designator C Emperor. Bone samples from Emperor specimen indicated some potential Kara immunity. Ooh la la. Single specimen captured for study purposes built containing facility. Constructed in volcanic region at 1.4 kilometers. Jesus Christ. Well the seam of the thing won't be able to get there because we cannot even get to a thousand kilometers. And we cannot get through there either. Whatever. Let's just get here. There's more stuff over there. What is this? Can I scan this egg? Please, yes. I can scan this egg. I like eggs. Sea dragon egg. Oh, so that's why that sea dragon outside was probably trying to attack this place. Yeah, that sea dragon outside destroyed this place because because it's probably in mother that the egg. Yeah, these aliens stole the egg, and the mother came here to take the egg back destroyed the base but then probably died of head trauma so interesting bones here all the rays i've never seen actually this ray what's this ray because we've seen we see, oh god we've seen this ray and this ray as well in well the safe shallows that's the rabbit ray this is the jelly ray or, or the ghost ray and i don't know what that is but this here, which we can't even see, this red one. No. No. There. See this red one? We haven't even seen this one. Race person. It's not, not to scan that. Whatever. We haven't actually even seen that one. That's probably in the volcanic place, because, you know. Everything is red. Whatever. What's through here? Oh, what the hell's that? Let's even not go towards that. They don't. Damn it, Yeah. The vibe detected facility permit closing at high speed. Exterior anchor. Hmm. Collision of seafloor. Yeah. Breaches were well, one specimen unaccounted for. They destroyed 340 specimens. One specimen unaccounted for. 
Can you mean? Evacuating, yeah. Uh, planetary quarantine protocol initiated. Warning, infected individuals may not leave the planet. So we're infected, so we're gonna leave, which is great. And yeah, so the Leviathan, that just confirms that the Leviathan attacked this place and died of head trauma, probably. Anyway, what's this? I don't want to go towards this thing. It's a thing. Don't you understand? Oh god, skeletal remains. I just can the skeletal remain. Poof, got it. Remains of research specimen. Yeah, very nice. Let's just get out of here quickly. Quick out of better. And what's in here? Residual biological evidence suggests indigenous life forms were brought to this location and subjected to intensive study. Yeah, cruelly, but look. It's a warper. Wait, these guys created the warpers, yeah. I think I think the aliens, yeah. The aliens created the warpers. Yeah, these weird teleporting dudes. The aliens created them. <laughs> 30 seconds. Yeah. Self warping quarantine enforcer unit. Yeah, see, the aliens made them. This life form shows signs of heavy gender modification, extensive medical gravitation. Where the hell is the life pod? See, my friend. No, it's And let's try on reading. It is the digestive system replaced by an onboard battery receiving energy directly from the main grid and distributed around the body. You see, assessment, programmable hunter slash killer, avoid. Yep. That, ladies and gentlemen, is the warper. Made by the aliens to locate infected specimens and kill them, basically. So that's why they hunt, they're hunting us, because, well, we're infected. Biological matter, I am about to scan that. So yeah, this looks so creepy, though. Like, just look at the warpers. You can look at them up close here. So weird. And that's why they, st they stopped making warpers because, well, the facility got destroyed, as you can clearly see. Let's scan this. Data pertaining to the bacterium is being downloaded. Caution. Detecting atypical fluctuations in blood plasma proteins. A self scan is strongly advised. Okay, let's do that then. First, though, yeah, I think we've searched through everything, so we can go home now. Or we can explore the rest of this place. We have three minutes left. Whatever, uh, we need food and water. Oh, God. Drink, drink, eat. Yeah, we're gonna run out of food very quickly. We can't slice things and cook them with thermal blade, but whatever. Let's actually, yeah, let's actually sc quick scan ourselves. So we can leave, of course. Let's quick scan. Self scan complete. Bacterial infection has spread to the skin and pulmonary system. Medical report recorded to date to bank. It is imperative you find a way to neutralize the infection. No, oh, hell no. What's going on? My hands! No! My hands are disgusting and green now. Oh god. What the hell has happened to my hands? Gloves, get the hell off. Just look at my hands, they're so green and disgusting, Jesus. Free cam, there won't be no light, but whatever, still. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's go back and freak them out. I want to look at these hands even closer. Probably not the best thing was the one looking at even closer. Okay, seem off turn the hell around. And face this way. Okay, good. And I'll give us light while I go into free cam mode. Then now, you see? See, now I can see them better because they're lit up. Look at these disgusting green hands. Ew. Oh, Jesus. We're cruelly infected, which is just amazing. Oh, God, the place is even over there. Holy Welcome God. aboard, Captain. Uh, you see, it's not even loaded in. Ow, now it is. Whatever, let's just quickly get out of here. Let's look at the area. I heard someone has used power. What the hell was that? Weird. Oh, yeah, it is the um, shield generator thing. Warpers, yeah. Let's just maybe quickly get the hell out of here. It's not safe. Nothing here ever is safe. Just quickly get out of here, shall we? Let's go forward. Okay, fog. Get a kind of house, but makes the place more creepy about the fog. A lot more creepy. Whatever, let's carry on going. So we just um, learned that we are even more infected and we're going to goddamn die. That is just amazing. Sweet Jesus. Whatever. We have indeed run out of time this episode, which is interesting. 
interesting. And I don't want, I don't want to leave this place because yeah, okay, I'm gonna end the episode here basically, and I'm gonna start off the next episode back here. What the hell is this? Let's stop everything. What is this? Jesus Christ, what is this? We're nearly approaching our crush step. But what is this? I need to make a base around this. I need to make a base around this now. What is this? Some kind of like alien tree. I like trees, that's kind of giant cove tree. I need to make a base here, like right now. I don't know how much it Giant cove tree. Buzz, bark, yeah, whatever. This thing. Jesus, I want to go inside it. With my camera. Head, basically. What's these? Like, oh my god, they shine even more. What are these things? Like, so look at this whole tree. It's so big. It's so magnificent. Well, guys, it seems... Oh, Jesus. It seems like we have found a great place to finish up the video. So. Indeed, we have indeed run out of time. And where the hell is... The music's so loud. Where the hell are you? So, guys... I'm gonna finish up the video here because, well, I'm not gonna make it base in time, and I think I just wanna stay here because I wanna cover and explore. So, yeah. Guys, I hope it's your video, and hope to see you guys next time where we'll carry on exploring this wonderful place. Goodbye, guys. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand.